The eighth generation of the model was sold and is being sold with us very successfully, although it is inferior to its predecessor in popularity, an indistinct design, increased dimensions, and weight affected sportiness. What about her reliability? Released since 2009, Crossdoor all-wheel drive off-road hatchback, created on the basis of a sedan, with a V6 3.5 petrol engine, 275 horsepower, and a 5-speed automatic was brought to Russia in the spring of 2011. The car, to put it mildly, was in moderate demand. The car of the 8th generation has become noticeably larger, more solid and respectable than its predecessor. It was traditionally produced in the form of a sedan and station wagon. The station wagon was not officially delivered to us, dealers explained this by a lack of demand. Both modifications are of high-quality finishing materials and workmanship, however, the leather trim of the steering wheel and gear lever is quite thin and wears out over time. Soundproofing is decent, although the wheel arches add decibels to the car's overall background noise. In the secondary market, Honda Accord dealerships are the vast majority. The engine range is made up of gasoline, force, with a volume of 2.0, 156 horsepower, and 2.4 liters, 201 horsepower. Turbo diesel modification 2.2L, 150 horsepower, was sold only in Europe. All engines are combined with a 6-speed manual transmission or a 5-speed automatic. In addition, the used Accord boasts a very generous bundle. Already the basic version of Elegance with the 2.0-liter engine was equipped with six airbags, ABS, and a stabilization system, climate and cruise control, electric windows and heated mirrors, rain and light sensors, fog lights, and alloy wheels. The executive version included a leather interior, a sunroof, and xenon headlights. The Accord 2.4 Type S also came with combined upholstery and an expensive audio system. The advanced version was supplemented with an automatic, adaptive cruise control and navigation. If you are unsure about the technical condition of a used Honda Accord, diagnostics are a must. Let's start with engines. Hondas are equipped with the chain and the timing drive, as well as a mechanism for changing the valve timing and IBTEC valve lift. If the motor rattles and is in a fever, in the cold, the phase regulator clutch has probably failed, 9,000 rubles, about the same amount will have to be paid for a replacement. The 2.4-liter engine is prone to excessive consumption of engine oil, especially when running for a long time at high speeds. He is demanding on the quality of gasoline. Because of the surrogate, the motor starts to detonate, then the knock sensor quickly fails, which is updated and at the same time its software is reflashed. Issue price, from 6,500 rubles. Transmissions Honda, as a rule, produces in-house. This is probably the reason for their durability and good quality. The main thing is that the transmission survives to you in good condition. To do this, the company prescribes every 45,000 kilometers to update the transmission fluid in the mechanism, onto ATFC1. The procedure is inexpensive, from 1500 rubles. The chassis of the Honda Accord is surprisingly strong, unless, of course, the previous owner participated in the races of street racers. Even the stabilizer struts are considered to be eternal. At least they have never been changed on most accords. But the stabilizer bushings, 650 rubles each, usually change to 90,000 kilometers, replacement costs 4,000 rubles. The lower ball bearings, 5,000 rubles, turned out to be just as durable, which change separately from the levers and, on average, serve 130,000 kilometers. In the rear independent suspension, the springs sag quite quickly, their replacement will require about 10,000 rubles. Engine. In engines, especially the 2.4 liter, the main drawback is the high oil consumption for waste. The manufacturer considers up to 300 G per 1,000 kilometers to be the norm, but in reality its consumption reaches 8001000 G. Many owners also often complain of an increased fuel appetite. Motor electrics are also very reliable. Transmission. Manual and automatic transmissions of its own production are extremely hardy, but demanding to maintain. Honda recommends changing transmission fluids every 45,000 kilometers, at least. Moreover, the machine should also be washed and, if necessary, renewed the oil filter. Electrical equipment. Very reliable. True, the power of a regular overly compact battery is not always enough. Lamps of external and internal lighting periodically burn out, fog light glasses burst, from 3,500 rubles. Suspension. The front suspension has double wishbones. 
chassis components are durable and long-lasting under normal vehicle operation. Even the stabilizer struts are indestructible, and the bushings change at 70,000 to 100,000 kilometers shock absorbers, 5,600 rubles each, were released on average 120,000 kilometers. Consumables of the brake system are short-lived. Discs, 5,500 rubles each, can withstand 50,000 kilometers, and pads have to be changed every 15,000 kilometers. The rear suspension is in good health. In the risk group, except perhaps the springs, 2,500 rubles each, which sag rather quickly. Body. The Accord body has a guarantee against through corrosion of 6 years or 100,000 kilometers, but the paintwork is weak. Chips appear quickly. There is one unpleasant nuance, the windshield mounting molding in the area of the pillars periodically falls off, and on the roof, due to insufficient rigidity of the body, two small dents appear between the hatch and the front pillars. Fog lights are low, which is why they often burst. Relatives cost 7,000 RU6H and the non-original is half the price.